I go where the sun goes, obviously. So I'm gonna start out in the bedroom because that's where the sun is. <sighs> I honestly cannot say enough good things about it. Like, you know, like I've been looking forward to these sunny days for so long. <laughs> so I'm glad that we finally have some sunny days. And I wanted to sit down and do a Lululemon haul. Sorry, I keep fidgeting with my hair. I just put dry shampoo in it and um, yeah, I haven't finished like styling it, but I need to wash it so bad. <sighs> so it is what it is until I can put it into a low bun. I also still need to get like change for the day as well. But yeah, I wanted to start off this video by doing a Lululemon haul. You guys, I really haven't been doing a Lululemon haul as much as I usually do. I keep checking every Tuesday for new releases. And I'm sure if you guys follow me on Instagram, you have seen this as well because every Tuesday I post on my stories my top picks from all of the new releases and i haven't been doing that for a while now because there hasn't been anything really that has caught my eye which is kind of insane i feel like they're kind of going through a low right now at least for me and things that like i would be interested in buying but i do have a few things here that i was really excited about so i'm going to share that with you guys i hope that this stuff is still available but regardless i'll link it down below lululemon does do restocks it might take some time on some items, but they do do it. So let's dive in. First thing I definitely wanted to share was their slides. I ended up getting a pair. I ordered these when I was out of town and I had them shipped to my mom's house because I just did not want to miss out on them at all. I'm so glad that I got them. They are extremely comfortable. I went true to size. I got a size five and I'm glad that I did that. I was kind of debating going up like a half size. But so far, like this band right here, it's so soft and so smooth. And same with the bed of this, it leaves enough room for like your feet and like the width of your feet. It's really soft, it's cushiony, it's lightweight. So definitely a great summer staple that I'm really excited about. Um, I hope that they come out with them in more colors and stuff. I was kind of like eyeing the white. That would be like really cute too. Okay, so other things that I got, ended up getting this finally. It's the ribbed back twist yoga bra. It kind of reminds me of like a high neck flow Y bra. It's not like that though, but I love like the ribbed on it and the color especially. This little detail in the back is so cute. It has like a little twist. I got this in a size four, which is my usual sports bra size. I feel like it runs a little bit big and the front cups are terrible i kept the front cups in during the try on and i would absolutely remove it otherwise it felt a little bit big and kind of like an awkward fit for me but i do think that the sports bra is really really cute i also finally ended up getting the cropped nulu define jackets bless your this heart one of you guys reached out to me on instagram was like hey this is back in stock go 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 because you guys knew that i want it in black so thank you for looking out for me so i did get it in a size two i like the define jackets i think that they're great just like light layering piece anytime you want to like throw on a light jacket it is very like form fitting it's the new look fabric so it's super super buttery soft which is just incredible this is the non-hooded version which living in seattle i kind of prefer the hooded versions but i do like this new cropped version it's way more in line with my style and the type of length that i prefer on me versus like the long one that covers your butt i like where this hits so very very happy about this these do run pretty small and tight if you're new to them so definitely size up in them and then getting to a few new additions for the soft ambitions line so oh sorry they don't call it soft ambitions anymore it's a soft stream i forgot but i ended up getting the straight leg crop this i got in a size two i think the size zero was sold out so i just opted for the two to see how it would fit i like how loose it is and not how tight it is so i'm happy with the size the length is like a little bit long so i could take it to lululemon for their free alterations just to like hem it up a little bit this color by the way this is like the color of the summer it is their lemon sorbet is that what it is color it's gorgeous has a little bit of lemon in it it's light enough where it's kind of like white it's stunning this version of the soft stream feels a little bit different than what i'm used to i feel like it's a little bit thinner i guess that's now that i'm saying it probably the main difference between the soft ambitions line and the soft stream this feels definitely more in line with like their pullovers which is soft stream versus the soft ambitions felt like a little bit thicker two pockets on it, it has like one of these cinch little waistbands on it really really cute 
pair of pants. This next set I literally die for. God, I hope that this is still in stock, but I did get a few more things in the lemon sorbet color. I feel like it's still neutral enough, you know? Like, I don't know. I think it's really great. Wow, my hair sucks right now. <laughs> So this is the Nulu and Mesh high rise yoga short. So it's so cool because it looks like a line shorts underneath it. The feeling feels exactly like a line shorts, but then it just has like this mesh overlay on top of it. It's high rise. It's a, they say it's a three and a half inch inseam. I guess it could be. It feels maybe a little bit longer, like more like four. Oh, it is. The liner is three and a half, but the length is four. That feels very on par. I'm happy with that. It's Nulu. So it's like so freaking soft and this mesh is really soft too and kind of like flows it's super lightweight these are unbelievable i'm so 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 happy about these and then i ended up getting the matching nulu mesh jacket like the defined jacket but in the nulu and mesh this came out a few weeks after this did but i was like oh my god this would be an amazing set and it sure is. This whole thing is completely mesh and sheer. I think it's such a cool addition for the Define jacket. I got this in a size two, the normal size I would get in the Define jacket, and I'm glad that I did that. I wasn't sure like how the mesh would compare. You know what I mean? And this does have a hood, which I love. I mean, it's mesh, so the hood's not gonna do much with the rain, but I love the detail, and it still has like the spots for your thumbs and pockets and all that sort of stuff, so love oh, love this set so much you guys and then last but certainly not least i did get a few pairs of the soft stream shorts i got the lemon sorbet one but then i also got this brown color i think that they call this prosecco but these are the two colors of them i brought over my pair of the soft ambitions shorts because i think that this is this year's version of it this is from last year and this is in the color trench so you can see that it's more of like a cool tone versus like this year's brown color but a few things that i've noticed right off the bat if you guys were curious of the comparison of these is that last year's soft ambitions is a lot heavier and it's thicker and this one is a lot more lighter weight which i do like because when you want to wear these in the summertime you don't want to be really hot and like sweat through. I was fine wearing these, but I do like how more lightweight that these are. They still kept the pockets on these. However, they did switch the band up top. You can see that this has like more of like a cinched detail and the jawstring is different in comparison to this one. The band on this is a lot thicker and it has pull like jawstrings on it. I also like that they took away like this huge Lululemon logo on the back in the center. And now it is just plain. There's nothing. There is a Lou 11 logo just like on the corner of the shorts. And then the pleat detailing down the back is different. And then I did like on last year's model how like this band at the bottom is like really thick. I always compare these to being like casual trouser shorts. Like they looked like fancy trouser shorts, but just in a casual material. This one just looks more casual now. It doesn't have like that thick band at the bottom, but anyways that was probably like an overkill <laughs> of a comparison oh the main difference between these and the soft ambition shorts from last year and the year before i would size down in these and go with a size zero but this year size two go true to size i'm so glad i stuck true to size in these shorts these are so good for the summertime. If you're looking for new casual shorts, get these. You're going to live in these every single day. All right, you guys, that is it. That is everything for the Lululemon haul. As you guys always know, everything will be listed down in the description box. But let's go ahead and get on with the rest of the day, right? Oh, he is enjoying the sun right now. <laughs> oh, little baby. You're so cute. I'm sorry to disturb you. <laughs> another day, another quick errands <laughs> during my lunch hour that didn't make any sense <laughs> i um i'm just running to nordstrom to make a couple of returns like i've been on the hunt for just like new sandals and slides for this season and some worked some didn't so i'm gonna go return at that and then i also need to go to the bingo as well so that's where we're going right now <laughs> mail. I think I have a couple packages there. I actually have a package. 
right here. All right, let's go check the mail. I gotta soak this up while I can, you know? And it smells like garlic bread. I want it. <laughs> Knew it. Okay, I have a lot to carry. I need to stop recording. Bye. wearing this like oversized top shop top man t-shirt today I like the back with my Lululemon bike shorts but I ended up pairing it with the new Lululemon slides and so I've been wearing these walking around the mall and everything my foot slipped out of them a couple times and it kind of like rubbed my foot a little bit where I had like some skin breaking I don't know how <sighs> So I feel like they might take like a little getting broken in and getting used to, you know? I got these shorts from All Saints. They looked cute online. I don't think that they came in my size. They're a size zero. I think that these are a size two. Yeah. I'll see if they fit and if I like them. But it looks just like casual, cute shorts, you know? Cute. Amazon. I got a blue sarong. This is handmade. I did not know that. Pretty blue now. Thought that would be a great pop of color. So I was ordering. What's the flip flop brand called? Havana's. Havana's. The Brazilian company. I ordered some off of Nordstrom and then I realized that Amazon had them like for so cheap. These were $10 on Amazon versus full retail price is like $28 I think. So if you guys are looking for some new flip flops for the summertime just like easy casual ones this brand is what I'm just trying to pronounce. Then look at Amazon essentially. So I'm getting it. This is just like a plain black pair. Walking on the beach, you know, just like those pieces that you can kind of trash a little bit. I like that these are thin too. They're not like super bulky. So this is a great Amazon purchase. <laughs> My order for the same sandals off of Nordstrom. It's like I ordered off of Nordstrom first and then I realized that Amazon had them at a cheaper price. And I was like, wait, what? So I reordered them. Yeah. Nordstrom, Amazon, and they are exactly the same. So little hack there, I'll link them for you guys. So for lunch, I'm just gonna go ahead and make my favorite salad. This is all of the ingredients that I use. I showed me making it and like specifics. I went into detail in one of my last vlogs. So I'll link it down below if you want like an in-depth watch on it, I guess. But anyways, this is the before and then now. And here's the after. Delicious. You guys, the salad is so good. If you guys make it, you have to let me know. I love it. A little TV to wrap up my my lunch with Oliver joining me today. Oh, the honor. I feel so honored to have you join me, little baby. Okay. Real Housewives of Dubai. That's what we're watching. Are you guys watching that as well? Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, no, you can't have my salad. Obviously, little man. Don't lick those lips. Previously, on the Real Housewives of Dubai, all these children have been surgery is going to want another one, yes, eventually. You're not allowed to. The one investing in it. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Kill this tonight. I don't think you've got a lot of orders coming. Cheers. I'm waiting. Tell me, how is it? No problem. Is that it? Daddy. That's all you're gonna say? Uh, 
I would put a camera in Juan's face, but that would be really mean. So I'm gonna put it in my face instead. But he's been gone for the last couple of hours because he's getting Invisalign. He's starting it. How is it? Wait, they gave you a lot of the like the little bumps. Yeah. What are they called? Let me see. Come closer again. Bumps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Babe, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Wow, no. they give you so many. 16? No. I don't think you know how to count. <laughs> I think counting is pretty simple. <laughs> it doesn't hurt right now? Did you get like your whole kit mm -hmm. of all your aligners? No. <laughs> Look who decided to join. Other than that, Wild. Fine. You come in and you just know how to piss me off. One thing after another. You can leave again. No. <laughs> I'm fine being here by I, myself. No, I'm here to stay. Do you want to show them? Your Invisalign? You have to come around the other side. <laughs> Juan's Invisalign. <laughs> <laughs> Get ready for the pain, babe. Why? I guess it's it was painful for me for like the first week when your teeth are like adjusting the most. No pain. Well, you've been wearing them for literally an hour, babe. I don't expect it to hurt right now. Exciting! Honestly, you guys have no idea how excited I am that he started his Invisalign. He was supposed to start at the same time that I did. And clearly, I've been done with my treatment for over a year now. I finished May of last year. <laughs> He had a few more issues than me. He had to like do some like surgery stuff like with his gums and deep cleanings and stuff. I don't know, his teeth are in a lot worse shape <laughs> than mine. So I'm like really, really happy and excited for him that all of that is getting under control and he started his Invisalign so that he can get straight teeth. Oh, I'm so happy that it's finally underway. I thought I'd never see the day. <laughs> Anyways, thought I'd pop on and share that with you guys, but I'm just sitting here working still. It's almost three o'clock right now. I still have a lot more work to do. So I'm just gonna continue to truck along. Oh, I would really like to wrap this up early if I can because it is a Friday and it's a nice day, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna get that luxury. There's a lot that I need to get done before the weekend starts and before next week as well, so. Let's do it. We're gonna try to go to the pool. It's so nice outside. We wanna eat it up. Mm? Juan with his new aligners. <gasps> Invisalign. I'm finally using the little tote bag that I got from Zara. I'm really excited about it. It's carrying all of the, the essentials. We're also gonna try to walk to the grocery store too. There's a few things that we wanna get for either dinner tonight or for the lake when we go this weekend, too. <laughs> All right, so on deck for dinner tonight, and yes, uh, we actually have a plan for dinner. We are making some of these little, cute little potatoes. This, it looks like meat, you guys, but it's not meat. This is the Impossible Burger. We've been really enjoying these. And yes, we're having burgers, I forgot to say that. <laughs> Burgers is just like so easy for us. We love burgers. We're actually cooking this on the stove too So it's like even easier for Juan because he doesn't have to like break out the grill, you know, so I'm excited for that Walk over here. I have um, these are the buns that we're gonna be using some brioche buns They're like the best types of buns in my opinion to use and then the potatoes are cooking along inside the oven here and then over here, I need to mix this together, but it's an avocado and red onion mix that we're gonna put on top of the burger. I also need to cut the cheese right now to put on the patties when we're cooking them. So, gotta do that. And be impressed. Look what time it is and we're having dinner. Like, what? Juan's cooking up the burgers here. We were just saying, it's like so wild because it smells just like burgers, like it's crazy. Mm. 
And then I also forgot that we we're gonna have a little bit of coleslaw, so I just whipped this up as well. And now the potatoes are there, and then I mixed that up too. I am so excited for this. This looks so good. No? <laughs> oh. You want a scoop of coleslaw? Ah! Verdict. Burgers. Burgers. That's that. Okay. <laughs> I like, kind of like that I'm eating like a plant-based burger and not real ground meat. It's like it's kind of cool. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Babe, is a dessert in our future? No. Like in an hour? Ah, Invisalign. How have you heard of the Invisalign diet? No, but I, I understand it. <laughs> it's a thing. Because it's like once you have your aligners in, you're not wanting to like take them out again. So there's so, babe, there's gonna be so many occasions that you're just gonna be like, nah, it's not worth it. <laughs> to like take them out, eat, then brush your teeth and put them back in. You know? Mm-hmm. Well, a dessert is going to be in my future, and I'm going to decide what I'm going to have. I don't know quite yet. But let's watch this. But I figured, while it's still light outside, I'm going to go ahead and end off the vlog here. You want to say bye? Peace? See ya. Deuces? Deuces. <laughs> bye, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed spending the day with me. It was a fun, productive day. So glad work is over and the weekend's ahead. Oh, Oliver's creeping up to say hi too. Do you want to say bye? Say bye. Right here. Look over here. Right here. Look. Look. Look over here. God, you're not like a dog at all. Look over here. <laughs> all right. He's not looking. Bye, guys. Have a good day. Have a good rest of your week. Have a good weekend. Whatever day of the week it is for you. Love you guys so much. And I'll see you in a couple of days in my next video. Bye. Here. Say bye. Say bye, right here. <laughs> Say bye.